Hi everyone! So I have a little haul from Globeland.com. They reached out to me and asked if I would go ahead and review some of their dyes for them. And of course I said yes, I love these kind of videos to share with you guys on what products are available out there. And sometimes it's hard to find some of these things, you know, um, when you're looking on the website because it can get overwhelming sometimes when they have so many products. So I really, really enjoy these videos and then I can link things for you guys. So here is the first die set that I got from them. I'm really excited about this one. So here it is. It's like little swirly stars that you can definitely use for layering. And these do come apart, so you have the larger circle with the stars, you have the smaller one with the stars, and then the smallest. So it's a large, medium, and a small. And then you have the center little star right there. And then you have this really cute little Cupid guy, so you could definitely use him for Valentine's Day. But then these I just thought would be a nice little layering piece, and they also give me like Halloween vibes, which you guys know is my favorite holiday ever so i'm loving this or if you are out like camping and you get some like starry night photos i think this would be gorgeous for that as well so i'm really loving that i can use this die for multiple reasons so i got that one for that because i just love that idea then the next die set that i got is to go ahead and use to um cut out for your ribbon so if you are sending a ribbon sample this one is really nice so what I plan to do is to go ahead and cut this out probably three times so here is the little die right here and then you wrap your ribbon around the center and then this one pops out and you're gonna wrap this ribbon around the center here so my idea with this one is to cut out a back and a middle that's a little bit thicker so use um, probably some chipboard and then to do another top layering piece and then it's going to end up being really really thick and good to go so that's why i got this one and then i like that it's going to go ahead and do some little embossing right here in the corner so that one's really cute now this next one i got i'm really excited about so it is bows so let me show you here we have this first bow that has like little butterfly wings or little angel wings right here so that's going to be really cute to work with then we have this next bow right here again this definitely has the little angel wings right there and then you can keep the centerpiece right here so it'll cut out like little diamonds to your bow which i think is cute and something a little bit different and then the last one is a unicorn theme how cute is that and then look right here it will cut out the little stars as part of the bow so super cute definitely really excited to try out the little unicorn i think it's just very cutesy and then the last one i got i am super excited about this one is also a layering piece which you guys know i love so I want to see how big these are. My thought process was to use these with rosettes, which I think would work. So you can put a rosette right here in the center, have this be the little bottom piece. And then look, this one comes with like little leafies in the center. There's this one right here. You could also use these as like little doilies. And then this one has a little feather in the center. So you can just go ahead and pop this out. You don't have to keep it in there and have that cut out. I get this one with the little hearts and then you get the little love right here super super cute love 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 this how beautiful is that look at the little bows and stars all the way around and then you get the little bow right here with the star then look at this one so pretty little butterflies can you see the little butterflies on the little doily wheel how stinking cute and then you get your little butterfly right there and then this last one is a floral themed so all of these are little flowers and then if you look right here it does a little embossing of the little leaf and then in the center it has that flower but i will be um, cutting out all of the center pieces and using these as you know a base for layering or as little doilies again 
as a layering piece. So I'm really excited to go ahead and, you know, start pulling these apart and start working with them and then share with you guys what I come up with. So stay tuned, you guys. I will have another video coming up on these dies. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. And um, don't worry, I will be linking these dies down below in the, des in the description box for you guys. All right. Bye, guys.